everyone. This is Melissa with the StockSwish.com and welcome. Welcome to HCG. This is the Stock Swish Show Play of the Day. And guess what? It opened with a swoosh. So really, really, really nice, beautiful, beautiful, fantastic app today in HCG. It was my top pick. Uh, you know, the thing is, though, that it really was very weird this morning. It didn't have a lot of volume, but I knew it would trade volume on the day. Um, it was squiggly. I rated the gap, though, as if, you know, it basically was at the price it was, but I wasn't sure where it was going to open. And, you know, when you're trading something and it doesn't have, like, intense volume in the morning, you can't be exactly sure where the price is going to open. As it turns out, it, it opened beautifully. It really just ended up being great because the stock opened and swooshed. So I did do this trade today, and you could have played it a lot of different ways. There were so many different ways to play this, and when you have something that's a very good gap, and when you have something that opens and swooshes, you can play it hard all day long, into the close, into the bigger targets, into the dream targets, hold it overnight into the core short. I mean, this actually broke past the number that I even thought. I think it ran out of time here. Uh, this is one of these ones where I thought it could even go to $8 today. I think it just ran out of day. Like, this went to eight fifty, which I really had conviction it would do. Um, or I wouldn't have done a late plan or done it in the afternoon, which I did. So you could have done just so many things with this. Let's just go over them all. That's a great thing about beautiful caps, actually. And I did say this in the room this morning. When something's working, it's paying you. Do it. Do it. Take more size. Take it hard. Play it. Focus on that one, one thing. You know, to do me up, trading isn't about playing the odds as far as trying to do as many different things as you can and seeing what sticks. It's about details, about focus. You rate the gap, you look at the gap, you watch it open and trade. You see it set up, you stick it on it, you take it, you trade it, you take the setup. You see it give you an ad, you see it confirming, you see it going, you see the target in sight, you see it breaking to the first target, the next target, you do it. You add to the trade, you stick with it, you follow it, you can play it and be done in the morning, or you can trade in the afternoon all day long. I mean, there's so many different things you can do when you know a stock is good and a gap is good and it's going to go just exactly where it needs to. And the swoosh helps you with that. I mean, that's the purpose of the swoosh in the first place. The reason that I invented it. So, anyways, let's go over it. Here we go. Beautiful. Boo! Out of the sky. Drops like a brick. Doop! Bounce off of here. And you know what the funny thing was? A lot of people lost conviction with this bounce. I thought that was funny. But a lot of people did. And then they didn't do the trade in here. And it had like a million confirmations and, and, and ads. Fell down here, rallied up, lowered the stop, fell down here, dropped. Now this is 16 cents for the next number. So you could have done a lot of different things in here. It didn't, it, 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 it was one, it was 12.15 in the afternoon. At 12.15 something sometimes can rally into two or something sometimes is done. So you got to make a decision, what are you going to do here? Uh, double bottom, I actually decided to exit this whole trade here. But then I kept watching it. Because this wasn't a number. Even though it did a double bottom, it wasn't a number. And so I was on the phone with someone. I was on the phone with Tom, actually. I said, I got to go, I got to go, I got to go. This is setting up again. <laughs> and I hung out with him and then I retook it. Good, great, fabulous, fantastic time of the day. Two o'clock major reversal time. And look, go, break, break the bottom. Boop. And it goes. And it goes to the next number. So... You know, I was here, I was doing stuff, you know, I had eaten lunch, I'm going to the Super Bowl Megalodon showdown or whatever it is at Times Square. <laughs> I'm going to head out there shortly here. Uh, Super Bowl Alley, Super Bowl Mania, I don't know what it is. I'm going to go find out what it's all about, uh, even though it's freezing, but I'm going to go. So I was planning on being in here this afternoon now anyways and just, you know, going out this afternoon. So it's still early enough to do that here before it really gets cold and before it gets too jammed, although it's probably jam right now. Anyways, this went to the next number, which is 850, which I was looking for here. But again, the right thing to do is to get out and then to get the next trade. Because what if you don't get this? So I really played this correctly here today. And, you know, I do have volume requirements. It's like one of these things where, you know, some days something works so beautifully so fast and has no volume. And I say, gosh, I wish I would have taken it with no volume. But you can't really do that. You can't, you can't do it. You've got to have the special requirements that you have for a reason. And the reason is that how are you going to know that trade is going to stick? How do you know it's just not one person in there or two people or three people? You need to know that it's really going to stick where the price is at. 
to take a position size. And so I have rules, and I followed the rules in this today. I also play this very hard. I did the right thing getting out then at lunch, and then I did the right thing getting back in. I didn't have to do that. But I saw where it held. I saw what rallied. I saw what it did. Time of the day was great. Love the gap. Love the swoosh. Just loved everything about it. I mean, this was really, really, really very good. But if this would have not worked here, then I would have had to be done for the day. But it was a beautiful morning in this. I hit it hard and then rallied back up. It was just really, it was a combination of a lot of things. One, the time of the day here. Two, it held the number of 920, which I liked from the beginning of the morning. And it was a resistance. And three, I just didn't have this 866 down written anywhere. So I didn't think it was something that was going to hold. And I really, really, truly thought this was going to 8 bucks today. And, and I think this gaps down tomorrow. goes to $8. You know, I don't know if it does it tomorrow, but it's headed right there. This fell into the close. I mean, just could have held right onto it. And the other idea is if you wanted to stay with it, you could have stayed with it through a rally. You could have added your cost average down, lowered the stop. But you would have had to keep the stop from the original stop. And it's like it would have been too much to get back here. And the sign here of this, you know, it was the right thing to do. But I played this very hard to, today and did a really good job and thrilled. I had a great day. And, you know, it was the swoosh that made me stick on it, stick on it, stick on it, stick on it. And I'm very aware of that. In fact, I'm doing uh, the live webinar in New York that I'm doing in my building on February 16th is about the swoosh. I'm going to go over this now. This just happened here. I just did it today, and I'm going to go over it. And there's some reverse swooshes we're going to go over too. So February 16th is a live event where I'm going to teach um, about the swoosh. For those of you that don't know about it, actually go into detailed depth about it. Learn this pattern. So I'm going to talk about it in a live webinar on February 16th if you're interested. It's at 1 o'clock Eastern time. Email me if you want to sign up and register. I need your name and phone number to get on the list to get entered into the building. You can't get into the building unless you're registered on the list for the, uh, for the event because there's security to even get into the elevator to even get anywhere. I mean, there's just tons of security actually in this building around this area here in Midtown and in my building specifically. I can't even get on another floor actually in the building. I have to ha I have a special fob that gets me to my floor to my apartment and then the other floors that have the special clubs I have a fob for. So like I couldn't even go visit anyone on a different floor. That's how high the security is here in this on this in this building. So it's going to be a really great event because the building is spectacular. And we're going to have refreshments. I'm going to do uh, the lecture on the swoosh. And also there's going to be a lecture on taxes for traders, tax do's and don'ts, which is going to be really timely and helpful for people at this time of the year, especially people who don't know anything about getting trader status. I think that's one of the most important things that's going to be talked about about the tax seminar, what you can deduct, and then about getting trader status. Because if you're not, you need to, you need to get that. Or if you want to set up yourself as an LLC, even if you're an individual, um, to, to trade under an LLC name instead of an individual. There's lots of questions you can ask uh, the uh, CPA that's doing the uh, tax seminar, which is right after mine on the swoosh. So it's going to be a great lecture. Anyone that's interested in that, email me at melissa at stockswoosh.com. I don't think the event's going to be taped. Someone mentioned it today. Was I going to have it taped? I'd have to hire a videographer for it. I don't think I'm going to do that. So if you want to come, sign up and come. And, uh, you know, it's just going to be one of those things, I think, where the live events are just not going to be taped. And you've got to come. You've got to come to meet me and see me if you want to be at the event and get the information. So anyways, it'll be great to meet some of you there. I know some of you already registered and some of you are coming from other countries already, which is really exciting to meet me. That's, that's so fantastic. This is HGG Stock Swoosh Show Play of the Day here for the Stock Swoosh Live Trading Room. Got a biggie here today, right before Super Bowl weekend. Big, big weekend here in New York City in Midtown Manhattan. Going to go to the Super Bowl showdown and take all the pictures. I'll send them out to everybody tonight. If you'd like more information on the next Golden Gap course, email me at melissa at thestockswoosh.com. It's February 8th. And 9th, okay, February 8th and 9th. All right, have a great day, everybody.